Hey everybody. <clears throat> um, today's gonna be it's gonna be a little different. It's gonna be short. Um, I really just wanted to play this and I figured I'd record it anyway. So this is um let me pull this up real quick. This is gonna be Halo 2. And um it's gonna be the E3 2003 um demo that they debuted um at the e3 conference i don't know i mean some of you might not know what e3 is uh, it was just a big game conference sort of like you'd like nintendo direct or like um xbox showcase or whatever um and you know they just debut trailers like uh cinematic trailers or gameplay trailers or whatever for games that were upcoming and back in 2003, Halo um, was huge. Halo Combat evolved. So the hype for Halo 2 was massive. And so, you know, it was like a big deal when they debuted this. Um, and, you know, it was a demo that was made for this, specifically for E3. Um, and so you were never able to play it because it wasn't the final version of the game. And the demo was never playable. So now... Um, it is, you can, there's right on, on the steam workshop, you can go on there, um, and just, just get it literally just Google it. And, um, it'll, I mean, it's going to be all over the place right now because everybody's checking it out. Um, but it's like, I don't know. I'm just excited to like check it out because I've seen this trailer so many times, you know, between like the hype for halo two and, just like seeing it nostalgically i've i've seen it a lot of times so i'm gonna try to play it similar to the way it's like played in the demo um all right but i mean i guess that's it let's missions Um, yeah, this is going to be, it's going to be interesting. So it's not in Halo 2 Anniversary. It's in Halo, the original Halo 2 graphics. So it's by DigSite, who's the mod team. Uh, this scenario is a composite reconstruction of the 2003 prototype Earth City mission assembled from an archive data or from archive data, inter internal research, and our own restorative work to showcase early Halo 2 development intended to be played as a rehearsed demonstration. Uh, mission elements do not account for deviation of expected scripted gameplay sequences. Your play experience may vary. So, like, this is, like, the... I, it's, I'm assuming they're aiming for it to be exactly the same as what they played at the E3 demo. Um, and the way they worded that is like, oh, so like they play it on stage. Oh my God. They have cutscenes and everything. That is so cool. Get ready to dance. You pasty bastard. What you good people are about to see is an operation. So the way they play it on the, at E3 is like, um, they will stand on the stage with a controller and play it now sometimes that's scripted you know what i mean um other times it's not and other times there's actually it's the guy actually plays i don't know what the answer to like if you asked me if they actually played it at the 2003 um conference i don't know it looked as if they did. It didn't look scripted. Who was first contact? Four oh fifth out of Diego Garcia. But don't expect a big welcome. The Covenant wiped most of them out before they hit the ground. Immediate. Grid Kilo 23 is hot. Recommend mission abort. Roger recon. Your call, Sarge. 
We're going in. Get tactical, Marines! Covenant ground forces own this city. We'll need to deal with them before we can kill that cruiser. I love that they have all the cutscenes. Very cool. I, I never thought I'd be able to play this, because... Obviously, you wouldn't expect to. Pile out! Go, go, go! I'll leave back the wounded. Keep me posted, Cortana. Of course, Sergeant. So... Let me, um... Let me check the audio levels, make sure I'm not shooting over my own voice here. Um... So, yeah, so, you know, like I said, I think they actually did Sir, play this. Perez, eh, company? CP's this way. Um, and if you haven't noticed yet, like if you've played Halo 2, most of these no voice tanks. lines Hank did stay in the game. Egg, and he needs an airway. I'm calling it. It's 1900. They the were... got hit as soon as we dropped in. Who's in charge now, Corporal? Uh, Sergeant Banks, ma'am. He's pinned down up front. Come on, I'll show you. Like, all these lines were in Halo 2, um, in the level Metropolis, which was the one where you fight the Scarab. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Three more coming left. I'm running low, man. Hey, Parsons! Yeah? Is it clear? You tell me. Grin is moving out. Covering fire. So it's kind of like an alternate universe version of that, it is what it seems like. Oh, no way, dude. That is so sick. Oh, that's so sick. So it has... Oh, God, dude. This is awesome. So, um, one thing you'll notice immediately is that the BR is not a uh, burst fire. It's a single shot. Um, and that's how it was when they played this, this demo. Um, also, there's no HUD. I don't know if I can die or not. I know that a lot of times when they do these, uh, they just set it to, like, you know, you're invincible. Because obviously you don't want to die during a, <laughs> a demo gameplay on stage. Um, one of the things that, like was really cool was like so if you if you go back on youtube and you watch um the e3 trailer they actually break all these just to like show destruction and stuff like that but it's so cool watching the so if you watch the trailer don't watch it um without like okay i guess watch it two times um watch it once like the high res one and then watch it again, um, the original one, like, there's, like, someone with, like, a camera that actually recorded at the conference, and you can hear, like, the audience's reactions, and so you can hear them, like, cheering when you get on, like, a turret, because that wasn't in the first game, um, Take my weapon. then you have them cheering in this part, too, and I don't know if this is gonna, oh, it did work, what? That's so sick. So you also hear people being like, yes, you know, like, because you could never, you could never dual wield in the first game. And dual wielding wasn't really, it was just like, you know, this was the first time they'd really seen it. This is so cool. Um, It's so accurate to the, can I switch? Oh, dude, that is awesome. This is so sick. I mean, it looks, it's exact. Um, obviously, you can't pick up weapons or anything, but. And I mean, this thing, like, this looked incredible graphically at the time. get on this I 
<laughs> this is so cool. Like I said, I kind of want to play it as accurate as I can to what they did. It's funny how much of this I remember because I've seen the trailer so many, so many times. <laughs> I feel like I, it almost feels like you've done it before, you know? Oh my god, I don't think you're supposed to be able to flip like that. That was something I always wondered too, was I wondered if they made it so you can't flip. Oh wow, damn it, I might have it bogged out here. because they never flipped in the demo. Oh my god, I might actually have it bugged out. Can I get on the other one? This is a regular turret. Oh wow, it's not going to let me go. Crazy. I might actually have to restart. I'm going to do it anyway. Um... Man, this is so cool, though. I could use a gunner, sir. The reload and everything is the same as what it was. Oh, it, like, sucked me onto it. That was weird. It forces you onto the vehicle. So it's kind of on rails, I guess. It's not like you can really go anywhere else. It's all... It's all boxed off. Man, this is so cool. The jackal shields are a nightmare in this. They also look a little different than they did in Halo 2. That better buff out. Ghost, making a break for it. Quick. I got him. You want to let me drive? I hope my driver doesn't flip again. Well, that is weird, because if this is, like, actually what they played, and I don't know if that's true. If it's, like, the actual file, I can't, I can't imagine it is. But that means that there was a possibility, if they did actually play it, that they could have flipped the Warhog during, during the demo. And again, it could have just been a scripted thing, and the guy stands there with a controller. So now that one of the brutes should jump down on that. Yep. I can't shoot him. I always wondered if he could do that. This is so cool, dude. That's another thing that was like they didn't have before is, is hijacking vehicles. They also show it with this ghost that comes from here. And that's another spot where, like, if you watch the video of the original one with the audience, they're, like, blown away because it's such a cool concept that they had never seen before. Like, the hijacking vehicles. And that kind of just became a staple in the franchise. I'll try and kill all of them here. I don't know how much I can really explore... Because you're actually supposed to go that way, I believe. But I'm going to see if... Or wait, I think you have to go this way. Yeah, that way, off the ramp. I don't think there's really much else to explore. That looks like a dead end. This might take me to the end of the mission if I get too close. I'm, I'm assuming it's going to, like, trigger a cutscene or something. This is so wild, man. So this all takes place in New Mombasa, um, which eventually ends up being, like, the main setting for uh, ODST. Oh, wow, you can just manually board it. So the first time I hijacked it, it 
did it itself. But you can manually board. You can't boost with the ghost. But you do end up in New Mombasa throughout Halo 2. Metropolis specifically. And if I go here, yeah, there. Okay. I love that it has all the cutscenes too. That's so cool. But like I said, this was like a big deal at the time. And people always like, like, you know, a lot of the fans wanted to play it. So it's really cool that you finally can. And it's not just some mod either. Like, it's not just some mod that they found on the internet. Like, it's the the Halo team supported it. Like, they the Halo team shouted it out. They put it on their blog. Um, I don't know how much work they had to do with it. Probably not much. Bingo. There's the cruiser. But it's it's just now, so cool. All we need I is I think this is sweet. So if you have MCC on on your computer, play it. You might as well. You have to launch the game without anti cheat to get the mods to work, but. It's not hard to set up. Steam makes things pretty easy now. Bet you can't stick it. You're on. Ah, dude. That's epic. That's epic. Cool shit. I love it. Man, that's so cool. Yeah, like I never I never would have thought that I'd be able to play that. And you know, it's like it's short, but it's cool to like I don't know, to explore the area. Um So yeah, I've said it a million times, but go go check it out. Go Like I said, watch the actual trailer, like watch it in like high res. And then watch, like, if you can search, like, I don't know, search for, like, Halo 2 E3 um, audience or something, maybe. And you get it. The, uh, the only one I've seen is, like, a pretty fuzzy picture, but it has the audience, like, sound in the back. That's why I think you should watch the other one first, just to get an idea of what's happening. But, um, yeah, that's it. Just wanted to play that and uh, kind of show it to you. Um, so, yeah. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching.